Well, here's my one gauge uh, Bing set that I got picked up. It's going to have to have some work done to it. It hasn't been detailed, hasn't been cleaned yet, but I wanted to run it. Uh, it's definitely going to need brand new pickup rollers. They are truly burnt all the way, through, almost all the way through. So it makes it uh, uh, running as intermittent from time to time. And it needs uh, new brushes, but regular Lionel brushes and springs will basically uh, fill the bill. They're, they're tubular uh, uh, brush holders, so it's not going to be any real problem. This thing is clean. There are virtually no dents on it. For a, for a train that was made in about 1913 or so, it is in really, really, really nice shape. So uh, I'll show you how it runs. The, uh, the other thing that I'm looking for, and I think I'll be able to find, is that's a Lionel headlight on it, although it looks real good. Um, that shouldn't be that big of a problem to pick up. They use the same headlight on their upper end steam engines and one gauge steam engine, oh, and one gauge, so uh, I, I think I can find it. Uh, that's a small price to pay. But uh, here it goes. It's a little sputtery at first, but it will, it will run, and it don't run too bad. I'm always afraid of it taking a header off the side there. And I built all this track, thanks to Philip Stuber. But I think you have to admit, for uh, right out of the box, it's, uh, it's not a bad running outfit. Very early American as far as I'm concerned. So, I hope you like it. And here it is.